Sounds good. Thank you. Mike was off. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Brianna. Hey, good morning. How are you doing? Good, good. How are you? Um, you know, it's it's Friday, kind yeah. of a day, but you know, then let's just let's just see how it goes. I'm happy to be <laughs> here though. That's, that's good. <laughs> right on. Yeah, but let's jump right into it. So starting off, I wanted to ask, what do you think viewers resonate most when they see old ram- old romances like you guys' um, kind of rekindle? Wow. Um, well, hopefully that uh, love is, love is, possible if you're open to it and it can always kind of come back around or it or just in general like it finds you when you least expect it you know it's not something that you can be like I'm gonna go find love you know because you're never gonna find it that way right it's like when you least expect it it knocks you upside your head and it might be with somebody who you used to love or maybe someone new but um when you're just going about your life living your life it just it'll find you so I think like that's kind of you know that that's actually what happened with with um, um, with these characters is is, is them finding um, finding each other again and rekindling that that flame that never never went away. It's not it was it just kind of like the flame just kind of like died down a little bit. You know, it was really 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 super low, and then they just ignited it again. Um, but yeah. What, what I will say to that is sometimes, or maybe most of the time, the greatest blessings come at the most inconvenient times. <laughs> fact. That's a fact, right? So, yeah. I mean, I think uh, that could be the case here. Now, it's up to you on how you approach and deal with that. Are you do you let do you let it go? Do you do you find the blessing or do you miss the blessing because of circumstances? See, I'm just leaving you in a cliffhanger right here. I'm not <laughs> you back here. I'm just kind of putting you little breadcrumbs out there. <laughs> well, thank you both for that. And so my next question for you both is describe your onset chemistry playing both Ellis and Sunday. Lit. i mean it's always great when look like we're actors it's not always you're not always gonna you know not i mean i think majority of times i've been very majority of times i've been really blessed to to work with great people and da 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 da. and when when you know when you actually like the person and and have a good rapport with the person and connection with the person that you're going to be working with um is it makes the job so much easier i mean thank god i mean that's what we had because we really didn't have a lot of time i mean it was like (laughs) i got the part and 10 days later uh, we were in new orleans we didn't get chance to get to know each other i mean we knew each other of each other throughout for you know work and we have a lot of mutual friends and stuff but like we didn't know you know so how do you i mean chemistry is hard to create but as actors, sometimes you gotta create it. But we didn't have to create it. It actually, it, it was there. Thankfully, like when when we when we when we got there, it was. I mean, even before when we when we met at the read, it's like it was like, all right, cool. This is, yeah. So, um, I know I feel so lucky that that we had that instant chemistry, and then that just. Um, transferred to screen and we took this journey together and then that only that chemistry only just you know um, blossomed from there Um, but I'm so lucky because he's just the coolest to to work with and and a generous actor and person kind person so it was like oh all right at least you don't have that okay okay okay. I'll be fine I mean I, I, I told him before, Joy's incredible. I mean, as an artist, as a woman, as a human being, uh, she's absolutely incredible. And it was something that was, it's just so easy. It was so easy. The one thing Joy said that I completely agree with, uh, we had chemistry from the beginning. 
but the chemistry grew uh, through our uh, going through obstacles together. There were many, you know, when you, there are very there are different challenges you have as actors uh, on sets. And, yes. and, you know, they're just different things. And we approached it together. We went through it together. And that just made our yeah. relationship stronger. It, it, it made me trust Joy even more. Um, and we, you know, we would confide and confide with each other and, 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 and talk with each other and work things out. And it just, it just made the chemistry deeper as the show went on. Whew. Thank God for that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, especially, um, Joy, you mentioned how, like, once you got the role, you had to kind of just move on down to New Orleans and just get, get yeah. ready to rock and roll. And so yeah. I'm glad that that worked out for the both of you, especially Woo! seeing the and it worked out on the screen. <laughs> so um, back to Ellis and Sunday, I want you both to tell me what is it that you love about their relationship and on the show? Hmm. Um, that, well, I mean, even, you know, there, there are these two people who were once so much in love and then things happen life happens and they go about their separate ways and each of them are living and loving and 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 um leading these lives and it's like they had no idea what they were missing until they saw each other again right yeah. because i mean yeah i listen no one's happy all the time or content whatever we're all we're all just trying to do the best we can this world, right and for the most part, you hope that you are just like, okay, cool. I'm, I'm all right with things, you know, like it's cool. Um, but then like, so lo and behold, someone comes into your life. You're like, wow, I didn't even know I need, whoa, well, I didn't know, I didn't know I need that or them, right? Wait a minute, hold up. And like, it actually wreck, it can wreck your whole world. Cause like what you thought you knew or what you needed, this person is showing you like, oh, wow, nah, you needed me right? <laughs> you needed me up in that. So um, yeah, I mean, that's an exciting thing, but also terrifying. And then how do you sort of, how do you know, both of them, whether with, with his family and, and, and trying to let love in, but also be the best dad that he possibly can be, or with her, um, her responsibilities to her father and her business, how do you let love in? I mean, we're, they're both struggling with how to um like let go of certain things to allow other things in and make space for those things and that is such an incredibly human like um you know thing that people can relate to and i just thought that was really beautiful and, and very real mm. yeah very real the, the one thing i will say that i i i, I really love between um our relationship uh the characters was that uh the honesty because things that happened in the past and the the story this story could not have been told if these characters did not have uh the respect for one another to be honest and open mm -hmm. in at every turn so that at least, uh, and even it, it, even honest when it may hurt the other person, you know. Uh, but the thing is, is that they they would not have a fighting chance if if they weren't. And you know, we'll see what happens if, if they wind up together or not. But <laughs> I'll tell you, I ain't giving nothing away. I ain't giving nothing away. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> I'll get you next time, Henry. I promise you that. <laughs> no, I'm just but um, that's all I have for today, and time is up. But Joy and Henry, thank you so much for taking the time to meet with me today, and good luck to you both during the premiere. I'll be watching. Thank you.